Welcome to our Through Text How to Create a Group tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to upload a group into Through Text. A group is the list of people that you're planning to send messages to. Starting at the admin dashboard, you can click on the Upload New Group button to get started. Alternatively, you can click on the Groups tab at the left sidebar and choose Create New Group. Then the group upload wizard will walk you through the five steps for uploading your group. The first step is to name your group and then choose the country for the validation of your phone numbers. I'm going to name my group new group. One tip is to name your group something that is easily searchable or recognizable. It will make your life easier. I'm going to leave the country set to United States and then go ahead and click next. Step two is where I'll upload my file. Your file must be in a CSV format to upload into ThruText. Other formats like XLS or TXT will not successfully upload. As you can see, you can upload in two different ways. You can either click Add a CSV, which will let you select a file from your computer, or you can simply drag and drop the file into the upload box. Alternatively, the external contact list option is present if you have a VAN integration set up and you want to pull your list directly from there into ThruText. You can consult the integration guide section of our help center for more information on using the external contact list option. I'm going to drag and drop my CSV to upload it and click next, which will take us to the third step of uploading a group, which involves selecting your required fields. There are three required fields in ThruText that must always be a part of your groups. Those fields are first name, last name, and phone number. Here you can see the three required fields. ThruText automatically populates a guess of what it thinks are the matching headers for those fields in a file. As you can see in this case, it correctly identified all three fields. If I were to click on one of those fields that I want to map, a list of all available headers that I have inside my file to choose from will display. I can also type in the name of what I'm looking for. Since my required fields are properly mapped with the correct headers, I can click next and move on to step four, where I'll map my custom fields. Here you'll see that every custom field you've created in the account tools section of ThruText is ready to be mapped. Just like in the required fields step, ThruText will attempt to match your custom fields with the headers it finds inside your file. Since I want to map the city custom field, I'll take a look here and see if that's already been populated. However, I can click on it and select from any of the additional headers that exist inside my file. It's important to note that you must first create the custom fields before attempting to map them in the group creation wizard. If you haven't created any custom fields first, then the wizard will actually skip the custom header step and move directly to the review step. Step five is the review step. Here you can check that all your mapping is correct and that everything is in order. If something seems amiss, you can go back and edit it. Remember earlier I said you should give your group a unique name? I probably shouldn't use new group. So let's go back in and add the date to the name. I'm actually recording this on October 21st, so let's click on the name and country step and add that to the name of our group. Now our new group is called new group October 21, 21. Then I'll click next and click once again to get back to the review step. My group is now set up correctly and I can click create group, which will start the group validation process. You'll notice that it shows yellow as it's validating all the numbers in my group. Once the group is active, it will turn green and it's ready to be used in a campaign. So that's the basics of uploading a group in ThruText. If you have any questions, please check out our help center or reach out to us at support at getthrough.io. Good luck and happy texting.